Laura here. Today I am going to be doing a collab with the beautiful Angie from 4F Beauty and Lifestyle and with Nuna from My So Called Life. So today we are carrying on with our Colourpop series but if you've seen any of my other ones I've actually run out of Colourpop 9 pan palettes. I don't have any more in common with them. But they said I could use either dupe it or just use the same colour schemes. So they're doing just my luck, which is a green palette. Now the reason why I didn't buy the green one is because it didn't actually appeal to me that much. There was one colour in it, that really bright, shimmery green, one mascara, mossy kind of green. That was the one that appealed to me most in that palette, and the rest were like, eh, I could take it or leave it. So I didn't buy that palette. But um, this is the palette I brought instead of that palette. And this is what I'm going to be using. This is the Revolution Chilled palette. It looks like this. And we're going to be doing a bingo. And so what I'm going to do is, because this has got quite a few neutrals in it, which just it's just green. I'm going to miss out all the neutrals and just do the greens. So um, in my palette, I've only got eight greens and two of them are glitters, which don't show up that great on my finger. I don't even know that you can see that. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull in this bright, bright green from Classy Cake Cosmetics. So this one called Honeydew. To it's not it's not exactly the same as the one in the Color Pop Just My Lip palette, but it's a bright shimmering green. And when I do my bingo, I'm going to miss out all the neutrals and add in this one to make nine. And I hope I don't get both glitters. <laughs> so I'm just going to go through my number generator. Between one, numbers one and nine. So here's the number generator that I'm using. And I'm just going to press start and it goes round and round. And then I will press stop and I get number two. So what I'll do is I'll just number them one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I'm just going to go through and see what numbers I get and then I'll come back. Okay, so here is my colour scheme. I got one glitter. So I got number two first, which was dope, which is this very khaki dark green, which it's a shimmer, but it's not very shimmery. And I got number four, which was this one here called Leaf. And I got number five, which was Bud, which is the glitter. And I got number nine, so I got the Classy Cake Honeydew one. And I got number seven, which is Natural. So that's the colour scheme I am working on. So I will figure out what I'm doing and then come back. Okay, I think I've figured out what I'm doing with these colours. And um, let's get started. I'll move my piece of paper with my colours, because hopefully I don't need to remember which ones I'm supposed to be using. And I'm going to start off with this colour here. So there is leaf. And I'm going to put that into the crease. I haven't used this palette a whole heck of a lot, so it'd be a bit of an experiment for me. Now my mirror is a bit far away, <laughs> because if I bring it closer, yeah, it ends up coming in shot because you might have noticed I've changed my background so I'm on the other side of the room because I wanted to have the natural light coming in on me which on that side there's no window there on this side there is so I've had a, had a bit of a change around to see how it works so this is the first time I've filmed with this background we'll see if I like it in this new position or not or whether I'll be changing it back <laughs> If the sun was coming directly in the window, that would be no good, but it's cloudy day today, so it's fine. It's a pretty colour. It seems to build up fairly well, so the Revolution Chilled palette so far is okay. And 
I'm just going to get a fluffy brush that's clean and just blend that out. Now, I would be amazed if you follow me and you haven't already seen Nona and Angie because we've done quite a few of these collabs together now and I've actually got a playlist with um, all the ones we've done so um, I can link that down below for you if you want to go and see what we've been creating with all the Colourpop palettes and as I said they were very kind and said oh we still want you to join in so just do a green look <laughs> that's what I'm doing I'm doing a green look Wearing my green clothes. And um, Nona is, well, they're both really sweet. Nona is such a, such a sweet and supportive lady. I'm just going to go back into these because I've blended it out so much. But Nona is such a kind and generous heart that she has. And she always leaves the most beautiful comments on my videos very caring. And she does lots of hauls and she's doing some unofficial kind of project pan stuff and she does she's been doing tons and tons of collabs as well. Yeah I'm gonna change my colour now. So I'm gonna go into dope which is this one here. I think this brush might be too big for what I want to do. So I'm gonna use this little pointy brush and go into dope. And I'm going to do the outer corner. I have actually already done my face this time. So I've got all my face makeup on. Just switching it off a bit. Switch up the background. Switch up the palette so it's different from everyone else's. Switch up the way I do my makeup. <laughs> just, I'm just doing everything differently. And... Angie is also very sweet and supportive and she does lots of makeup tutorials for any school level so if you're a beginner and you want to know exactly how to do something and you want to see it all in real time because she doesn't edit out what she's doing, all the steps and things. She shows you exactly how to do it and she's got some good tips on how to apply. And she does hauls and trying out palettes and collabs and things as well. And she's got a series on her channel that's um, taking photo inspiration. And she does lots of collabs with people with that and I've done a collab with her on that as well. And that's what we've got so far. So I've used this one and this one so far. And now I think I'm going to go into this one, the classic kick one called Honey Dew. And I think I, I might, I'm not going to use some glitter glue to start with, I might go into that after. Oh, oh I'm rose too far away, I can't see what I'm doing. I'm too blind from this distance. I'm going to have to move my mirror closer. How close can I get it without it being in frame too much? My camera keeps moving and I think it's the cushion behind it that's pushing it. Hang on. Is that better? That hurts. It's still, it's still moving. I'm not quite sure why it's doing that. <laughs> I had that trouble once before but I changed something so it didn't but I don't know what I did. <laughs> so if I suddenly go out of frame, it's because I haven't noticed my camera's moving. So that's what I were up to. Yeah. <laughs> if I sound funny, it's because I've got a cold, and my ears are all blocked, and I have no concept of how loud or how softly I am talking, because. I'm just feeling really deep here, and I feel like I'm hearing everything underwater. And um, I went to the chemist and got one of those nasal kit things that you squirt the saline water up and it clears out all the cavities. But I'm so blocked up, it didn't make any difference. 
difference whatsoever. So it didn't do anything. I've done it twice now on two different notes and it makes absolutely no difference. So that wasn't very helpful. <laughs> I'm going to go back into dope, which is that dark green. Now, I've been a bit MIA off YouTube lately. I haven't been around that much. And I haven't even make it that much, just because, you know, life in general. <laughs> and um, every time I sit down and do my makeup, I remember how much I enjoy it, and and I, and I love sharing it with you. So I need to get back into my routine, and and I am I am trying to do that. Well, I am going to do that. I'm going to say yes. I am going to get back into routine. I'm not going to just try. And that's what I've got so far. Oh, I haven't used this colour yet. I might put that in between there. Maybe. Or I might deepen up. Actually, I might deepen up up here with that colour because that's more that kind of shape. So that is natural here. So I'm going to... Deepen up the crease with natural. I might even use natural on my bottom lash line. And that's what they're looking like. Now I want a pencil. I'm going to use this pencil here. This is very old and I don't think it's available anymore. It's an emerald green. But any, any green. And this tiny little flat brush, and I'm going to go back into natural, and I'm going to stamp that over the liner. I even got around to doing my nails green. I got lazy and didn't take the stuff off underneath. I just went over the top because I have been sick and I was worried I was going to run out of energy because yesterday got um got up and organised school stuff and things and walked the dog and did my little morning routine and then collapsed into bed and slept for the rest of the morning so uh, that, that wasn't a very productive day now i think i'm going to go back into the classy cake one now if you don't know who classy cake is her name is sandra and her channel name is my real california life and it always sees a date when I say that. Because my so-called life for Nona and my real California life, in my head I keep getting those names mixed up, even though they're different. <laughs> and I don't want to use that glitter, but I have to put it somewhere. Because I quite like it the way it is. I think what I'm going to do, because the glitter is quite dark, I feel like I'm not saying glitter. I'm not really slurring my words with this cult. I think I'll put some glitter glue here and I'm going to put some of that dark glitter, glitter. <laughs> on the outside there. So I'm just going to use my e.l.f. glitter glue. And I might use a little brush for that. So I'm just going to use a tiny little brush. I think this is... Oh, it is a little brush. I was going to say, I think this is a, pen, a little pencil brush, but it's not. It, it does say accent eye on it. It's a very cheap brush from Kmart. But it's quite handy to have these little brushes when you want to do stuff like that. Now, how am I going to get the glitter on my... Does it work with my silicone one? I'm going to try it with my silicone one. I don't know that I wanted that much glitter. That was a bit too much. It wasn't really the look I was going for. But I'm going to have to leave this over on the other side now. I thought like a little sprinkle would be fine. But it went on a big, huge chunk. <laughs> Oops. 
I had it on my hand and now I've got it on my face or over my face and I've done oh, because I've changed things around I don't want to put anything so I've done my face first so got <laughs> glitter stuck to my face now Here. I think I've got way more glitter on that side than I have on this side. Let's try and put a little bit more finger. <laughs> Maybe I should have used a brush just to have a little sprinkle. <laughs> Never mind. Here is my green look. So hopefully Angie and Nona will approve that it's green enough. I think it's pretty green. <laughs> And I quite like it, apart from the glitter. I didn't enjoy using the glitter at all. But <coughs> and it's a shame it's got two glitters. Well, it's actually got three if you count the silver. But the silver's a bit finer. And this one looks like a glitter, but that's, it's just a shimmer. It's not. So I think if those two colours there were just shimmers instead of glitters, it would be better. But I still like the mix of the green and those browns that are in this particular palette. For the Revolution Tilled, tilled palette. But I think adding in the Honey Dew from Classic Cake was a good idea because it really brightened up the look and I was glad I actually got that in my colour scheme. So here's my colour scheme. How did I do? I haven't got any lipstick on. I've just realised. I'm just going to go nude. Here is my green look. With my not a dupe for the just my look from Colourpop. <laughs> just using green. So thanks for watching everyone. And I will link Nona's and Angie's channels down below so please go and check them out and have a look at their videos and give them a like and a comment and some love and tell them that you came for me if you haven't seen them before so I'll see you next time bye